jetzt wieder. Okay, so neu Haram. Hier mit meinem Let's Play von Felix Wright Ace Attorney Spirit of Justice. Und beim letzten Mal haben wir weiter Rafer ins Kreuzverhör genommen und gehen jetzt davon aus, dass Nana etwas damit zu tun hat äh, mit dem Mord von äh, Inga. Und dass sie vielleicht sogar die Mörderin sein könnte. Die Wirklichkeit besteht. Wir haben sie aufgelistet. Aber Garen nimmt das mal wieder nicht sonderlich ernst und macht uns sogar hier das unmoralische Angebot von wegen, dass sie uns gehen lassen würde, wenn wir das Ganze einfach sausen lassen. Vergiss es, Frau! Das machen wir nicht! Wir sind nicht so scheiße wie du! If she thinks I can't do this, she's got another thing coming. But first, I have some serious thinking to do. I say that new evidence indicating a different suspect Gibt es leider nicht. Zumindest noch nicht. Such evidence does not exist. Hm, <laughs> just as I thought. I was so hoping you'd present meaningless evidence and allow me to claim your hat. Glad I didn't walk headfirst into that one then. So, what now, Apollo? Well, unless we can prove that Nena killed Inga. This trial is over, and so are we. Isn't there still a way to get the proof we need? Even without evidence? You know, a key means of obtaining testimony here in Kurain. Huh? Wait, are you actually suggesting... It certainly won't be easy, but it's worth a try. Your Majesty, a crucial step in uncovering the truth behind this case has yet to be taken in this trial. But I'm positive that I can back up our claim with this one step. You mean you will be able to prove that Lena killed Justice Minister Inga? And just how do you propose to do that? With the help of a certain someone. You need help? From someone? Well, I can't imagine who it could be. But I suppose I must ask. Whose help do you need to uncover the truth? Um die Wahrheit herauszufinden, brauchen wir die Hilfe von Rafer. But that is... N me? Ich weiß, das ist eine groß, ein großes Hindernis für dich, Rafer. Aber du musst das schaffen. Wir glauben an dich. Du schaffst das. Here in Kurain, legal proceedings include the viewings of the victim's final moments. But that requires your benevolence help. Such information is just as vital as any other piece of conclusive evidence. If you're right about this, Rafer's power should enable her to see the very moment Nena stepped Inga. It will be hard to watch your father's murder, but it's the only way to uncover the truth. Your benevolence! We need you and your power! You need me? Wretched simpleton, did you not see what ensued in the previous attempt? You would only succeed in wasting more time. Or is it, uh, is it your goal to make your collapse again? Objection. The princess said she was prepared earlier. Besides, it's her duty as royal priestess. I'd say it's all up to her now. Am I prepared? Prepared to fulfill my duty? Isn't a divination seance required at all trials anyway? If so, I imagine there'd be a problem with handing down a verdict without one. Hmm, indeed, it would be problematic. Under Kuroyinis law, a seance must be conducted before a verdict can be rendered. Yikes! Hm, 
must you try my patience so? If I must dispense with that vexing law, then dispense with it I shall. Huh? As ruling sovereign of Kurain, I proclaim the following. Und ja, sie schreibt mit ihrem fucking Fingernagel. Henceforth, the divination seance shall be optional. What? She has the power to do that? She's just rewrote the law with a flourish of her hand. Mother, I... I do not wish for the trial to end like this. It is as the defense said. I must not neglect my duty simply because I am afraid. I shall go through with this time. I will conduct the seance once more. Rafer, do not be fooled by his lawly guile. You are not prepared to witness your father's death. But... Hornhead needs my help. Rafer, did you not tell me earlier? Did you not tell me you were prepared? But despite your grandiose posturing, you collapsed in a most piteous fashion. <sighs> Frau, halt dein verschissenes Maul! Even worse, you are half arid in your insights of late. For has not the bot one they overturned them more than once? <sighs> you cannot be trusted to keep your word, nor can you reveal the truth through your insights. So I say to you, be gone! This sacred hall of justice has no need for such a worthless royal priestess. Jetzt hast du's geschafft! Fick dich, Frau! Fick dich! Hat jemand eine Shotgun für mich? <laughs> Worthless? Wow, how can she that to her... Can she say that to her own daughter? So, mother, you think me worthless? Um, her benevolence uh, t that says she can do it, doesn't she? So I don't see why you have to condemn her before she's even made the attempt. Very well, Horn Devil. If you really are so bent on having a seance, I shall give my consent. Really? However... Should Rafer fail once more? You two, and the accused, shall all be executed on the spot. Come again? <laughs> this is proving to be far more entertaining than I had anticipated. Well, lawyer, what say you? Will you vergue your life and call on Rafer to perform a divination seance? Ich möchte immer noch eine Shotgun für sie. Also... Oh. Schlimmer als von Karma! Also jetzt Manfred. Just wow. Ich sage... Rafer... Egal, was diese Frau da sagt. Du schaffst das. Wir glauben an dich. Mach deine Seance. I don't think you're worthless, your benevolence. Far from it, in fact. If you say you can do it, then I believe in you. Hornhead, I do not understand. If I fail, you will be put to death. I know you collapsed during your previous attempt. I 
I can't even imagine how terrible it must have been for you. But despite that, you are willing to try again. I have faith in that conviction, in that courage. My... my courage? Ah, so she was doomed to fail if she didn't have the courage to perform the seance. But it looks like she's got the determination to try again. Right, and that's a bet I'm willing to take. But... It is as Mother said. I've erred in my insights as of late. Not only have I failed to reveal the truth, I've also contributed to false accusations. Knowing that, can you still say that you believe in me? Objection! I wouldn't take stock in those words, your benevolence. Despite what your mother says, I don't think you made any errors at all. Huh? In the trials I've been a part of here in Kurain, I would have never proven my client's innocence without your seances. Because even though they didn't always reflect the absolute truth, the insights they provided served as vital leads to finding the truth. Vital leads? My seances? So please, your benevolence, try to perform the division seance one more time. Rafa, stop this madness. It is for you your own good. You are ill prepared to face your father's death. Go, leave the sacred hall at once. No. What did you say? I said no, mother! For I am the royal priestess of Kurain! I have no need for you now. Even if I do, you do not need me, mother. Hornhead and this Hall of Justice do! He proved that to me by risking his own life! It is because of him that I now understand! The divination seance is my sacred duty! I must fulfill it, no matter the risk! Your benevolence. Mother taught me that the divination seance was a mirror reflecting naught but the truth. But I began to have my doubts after Bob had disproved the insights it offered. And now, I don't even know who or what to trust anymore. Father, mother, even Nana, I had believed in them above all others. But... I finally know now. I know in what I can trust. The royal priestess must debate each seance with the preceding lawyer and prosecutor. so that it can be interpreted properly. That is how I believe trials here in Kurain should function. Therefore, the Hall of Justice needs me. It is my power that leads trials towards the truth. That is my sacred duty, and I will never shirk from it again. That right there, your benevolence, is the product of what you've learned in your struggles so far. The truth that you realized with your own strength. As my sacred duty, I must ensure that it is fulfilled. I must have the courage and resolve to see it through. Your eminence, the royal priestess says she will conduct the divination seance. I see no grounds for you to forbid it. 
Unless, of course, you are worried that it might reveal something you find inconvenient. Mother! I am done letting you have your way! Rafa, You would actually rebel against me, your mother and queen? Though I am scared to see my father's death, I must face my fear! That is what Hornhead has taught me here today. Rafa. And I am prepared to face my father's death! Your Eminence, it seems the princess is more grown up than you thought. Rafa! Well then, let us proceed with the divination seance. The victim's final moments. This should be interesting. I wonder what Inga's memories are going to show us. Du schaffst das, Rafa. Oh, Holy Mother, we hold this divination seance in your name. Let the eyes of everyone here be clear and our ears be unstopped. Oh, dance of devotion. Guide the victim's soul to me, so that we may receive their final memories in the pool of souls. Noch mal einen großen Applaus für die Royal Priestess. Du schaffst das. What in the... A faceless being? 
What the heck? His face. It's just like... That picture of the founder. I think that's the last thing anyone expected to see. Oh, father. What was it? What was it you saw? Are we to understand that this was the last thing the victim saw? Yes, there can be no mistake. That was what my father himself witnessed. Hmm, oh very strange. You don't suppose the Holy Mother possessed the accused and slew Minister Inga for planning a coup? The Divine Wrath of the Holy Mother? Oh, Holy Mother, we are ever grateful for your blessings! Ich will ein Kind von dir, Evers! Talk about a sharp left turn into the Twilight Zone. You know, there's one thing in there that caught my attention. That laugh. Who does it belong to, and why are they laughing? Who knows? Though I suppose it could be Dirk after she slew my husband. Uh-huh. But that fetter didn't even have a mouth. <laughs> I think we're done here, lawyer. How so? You claim that Minister Inga was stabbed in his private quarters and, feeling no pain, went to the tomb where he eventually fell dead. But this seance vision proves he was stabbed in the tomb and felt great pain, no less. Oh, that. Therefore, as I asserted all along, it was the accused who stabbed the minister in the tomb. Ah! Everything just backfired! Big time! Wow. Karen has the devil's own luck, doesn't she? Now then. I shall give voice to the soul of the deceased. Listen well and heed these words. Stimmt. Weil die, Insa die Seance ist ja noch nicht ganz vorbei, denn jetzt kommt ja noch Rafers Inside. Okay. At around 3 p.m., my father was waiting in the tomb to make the hostage exchange. He was drinking grape juice while gazing upon the picture of the Holy Mother. He had been waiting, vigilante, when suddenly he heard Dirk's voice. The next moment, he was stabbed in the back and collapsed. My father tried to shoot his attacker, but he missed and the attacker let out a laugh. Um... So, what now, Mr. Wright? It's up to us to knock holes in Rafa's interpretation of Inga's memories. In other words, we need to prove that her understanding of the could be mistaken. Okay, I'll, ca I'll give it a try. Können wir jetzt erstmal Pause machen? Weil mit der Divination Seance und der Interpretation be befassen wir uns dann im nächsten Part. Egal ob positiv oder negativ, bitte mal gern gesehen, dort was meinen Satz und wir sehen uns das nächste Mal wieder. Sehr guys!